hey guys welcome back to another video so in today's video we would be discussing some but other approaches as well and we would be making enhancements to our project that we were carrying on so till now we created uh, this project and this was the navigation bar component that we created uh, in our previous video okay so now if we go back to our amazon login site uh, we could see another navigation bar in here this is the primary and this is the secondary one so that uh, from where we could uh, move over to the site pages okay but in our experience builder we are not having uh, of such of kind okay so we have to create this why because if we want to move from one page to another or if a user wants to go from to any section like mobile phones tablets or clothing section so from where he will uh, go so they will all be redirected from on uh, this page see you could see the uh, links that are being created downward so we would be trying to replicate this we would be just creating a simple navigation uh, component but yeah in this also we would have the mixture of grids only so that this could be pure lwc development and we could also get insights about how we should structure the things okay so this was our previous component that is was the navigation bar now what we would be uh, doing is we would be creating another lightning component uh, navigation bar helper or uh, okay navigation bar helper is being created okay so let us clear all the things and now we should open the js html and in this now i need to add another class as well that is navigation bar css so our css is also there so uh, our main thing would be in our html and css only okay so div uh dot sds grids that we would be using again and gutters for the padding and i would give this uh, class a uh, sub navigation and this we would be creating a columns Okay, so now our navigation bar component is ready. Uh, three items. So home. Uh, in this, what we could have is, let us check like what we could create like best sellers, mobiles, customer service. So out of the one, we would be creating any one. So this is the thing in here. Okay. and for the book section how it looks so this is your uh, carousel and these are your search sections so see uh, the book names and the things in here so we could create these and uh, okay so yeah we could create like this a mobile books uh, electronics so home other section would be books mobiles and today's deals or uh, we could have fashion okay just random and the, for this sub navigation i would be giving background color should be my black and uh, my color should be white 
okay so let us see that how the things look first we have to update the meta as well and we have to expose this to the community as well okay so lwc targets so see uh, two things community page in the community and uh, default we have to expose else you might not see that component over there okay so this is done going back to our org uh, refreshing the page okay so navigation navigation bar helper drop this to in here only okay all of the things homes books mobiles and fashion they came in the same way why what happened hsld is great guys hsld is good so yeah these things are easy to debug as well so let us see again refresh the page okay see uh, home books mobile and fashion okay one thing more is that uh, see the color of this is slightly different so what could be the color let us inspect so the color in here is f double one so now we have to give this color only okay so yeah and this is also a blue this is not exact blue color as in this see same f1 f1 uh, so yeah this would be the exact color and we want uh, in here now there is very very little spacing if we see if let me uh, just deploy this and uh, first what we would do is we would open this in a preview mode so uh, see uh, home books mobile and fashion uh, very little space so what i do would do is uh, i want to now uh, okay i want to now add some padding as well in the slds uh, classes as well so uh, if i write that slds dash column padding or what you could do here is instead of this uh, you can give the padding in here only because the slds dash padding around uh, medium padding so yeah we could have this and uh, we could have this and uh, let us see how this is going so again refreshing the page so see now it is looking somewhat as per our requirement but one thing is there like see on uh, this now it is coming a hover kind of thing okay hover is also coming and but our hover is not coming and things are in the center aligned and our things are not center aligned okay so in our sub navigation class first you do is text align is center and now we want uh, to add your uh, what we want is uh, we want hover style okay so uh, like sometimes what is there like we try to give this slds column and we try to give this hover so let us try to give this hover what is the hover effect in here so let us say background dash color should turn to uh, let us say green type of green only okay green yellow okay so yeah this one and the color should be same so no worries so let us see that does it happen do or not 